I have completed my mission on Voss. The voice of the Emperor has been freed. Yes. We are again aware of the voice. Preparations are being made to secure a new host, but the rituals take time. You have done well, Roth. The Emperor is pleased. But time never pauses. Events are progressing faster. With the help of Armageddon Battalion, Darth Vauron has gained a foothold in the battle for Corellia. Everything now hinges on Vauron's survival. Varus needs him dead to be named the voice of the Emperor. Send me to Corellia. I'll stop any attempt on Vauron's life. The Wrath anticipates the Hand. Varus has marked Darth Vauron for death. Assassins have been sent. Their missions must end in failure. We will learn more and brief you when you arrive on Corellia. My lord, I'm afraid we cannot go to Corellia at this time. The Empire has enacted a martial law blockade of the entire system. I'd like to see someone try to get in my way. The blockade is impenetrable. The Imperial fleet has been equipped with special transponder signal emitters. Any ship without this emitter sticks out like a sore thumb. Hmm. I've never heard about such an initiative. I've been monitoring Barris's communications, Lieutenant. He only implemented the order recently. Probably to keep us away from Corellia. Without a signal emitter with Corellia space clearance, we will be noticed the minute we enter the system. But I believe I have a solution. That's why I keep you around, Quinn. You're my answer, man. It has been an honor to be that, my lord. I intercepted the transmission granting Corellia clearance to a Class A starship not far from here. Lucky us. Quite. We can board the vessel and take their signal emitter. They won't part with it easily. We'll have to go in there guns blazing. A lot of fellow Imperials are going to die. That doesn't sit well with me either, Lieutenant. Nor with me, but it is a necessary evil. There are ways to minimize the casualties. I know the schematics of Class A starships by heart. I could accompany you on board and lead you directly to the transponder station. Just a suggestion, but it would help expedite things. <laughs> My lord, I could not leave you to this fate without showing the respect of being here to witness it. Get back to the ship, Captain. I didn't say you could disembark. I regret that I have been disobeying many of your orders of late, my lord. It pains me, but this entire scenario is a ruse. There's no martial law and no special signal limiter. Barris is my true master. He had me lure you here to have you killed. After all we've been through together, I even helped you take out Moth Broisk. You've helped me immensely. I act today with a heavy heart. But without Barris, I'd have no career. I didn't want to choose between the two of you. But he's forced my hand, and I must side with him. Wow. Captain Boredom makes a wake-up call. Did not see this coming. He fooled us both, all this time. It hasn't been easy keeping the truth hidden. Vet, ever since my lord removed your shock collar, you have been an insufferable pain. You know what? I say we kill this Imperial punk. Charming to the last. No more time to waste. It's my extreme pleasure to take you out of the equation. Barris and I have been planning this for some time. You'll have to face this fight alone, my lord. I really thought you were smarter than this. I'll show you how smart I am. After all this time observing you in battle, 
I have exhaustively noted your strengths and weaknesses. These war droids have been programmed specifically to combat you. I calculate a near zero percent chance of their failure. Your confidence in the odds is your biggest weakness. If anything, I am underestimating my droids' chances. You'll find they are virtually immune to you. I'm sorry it's come to this, my lord. perfect killing machine for you. I was painstakingly precise. This proves you are inept. I'm better off without someone who makes such a mistake. Perhaps you're right. I have betrayed you. Conspired with your most hated enemy. I know it is meaningless to express my deep regret. I don't expect your mercy. I will keep you alive. And we will see if you earn my trust again. My lord, I'm... This is unexpected. Darth Barris would never forgive such a failure. If you will permit me to stay in your charge, my dedication to you will never come into question again. I will not hesitate to destroy you the next time. There will be no next time. I swear, this interruption has delayed you enough. I'm eager to return to the ship and put this behind us. The ship is through there. Prepare for departure. I'll join you shortly. Of course, my lord. One thing, my lord. Do you plan on telling the others what happened? When it's appropriate, I will inform them. I appreciate it, my lord. I will see you back at the ship.